Greetings and welcome to Yonder, the Cloudcatcher Chronicles. I'm Catherine of Sky, and I, first of all, I would like to say a huge thank you to Prideful Sloth for granting me a key to play this game for you guys today. Thank you so much. Um, I have been waiting for months and months and months for this game to come out because it looks like such a fun um, game and it has a really nice story and I would really love to, to get into it right now. So I just, uh, I started a new game just to get used to the controls and such and I was able to do so very, very easily. So let us start a brand new game. Uh, shall we be male or female? We could be either. Um, I don't know. I, I think the male character looks kind of cute, but oh, <laughs> what shall we name him? Um, uh, let's okay. First of all, let's just choose what he's gonna look like. I'm always fond of red hair and green eyes. Um, let's see, body shape. Uh, ooh, you can change their shape altogether. Oh, that's really neat. That's really cool. I like this. And then body size. Okay, he can have a very very skinny body or a much bigger body. Cool. Oh, that's very nice. I like it. Let's look at the females as well. You can do the same with her. Oh, that's so cool. All right. Well, let's, you know what? We can go with the female character. Why not? Um, I'll have trouble if we have to name, <laughs> name, name a him. A him named Catherine might be kind of strange. Right. So let's go with her and we'll just say play. Our dearest child, it broke our hearts when we sent you away, but it was the only way to keep you safe from the darkness that poisoned our land. When the day comes that you seek the truth, trust in the celestial compass to guide you. It will lead you far across the sea, into darkness and into light, but it will always lead you home. Home to Gemea. That water looks so gorgeous. <laughs> oh, look, a ship with sails. So cool. All right. Okay, I think that's me. There I am. Fantastic. Okay, say hi. Okay, uh, we can press F to talk to Jib the Sailor. This is amazing. I thought Gimea was just a made-up tale. I'm glad I came up from the kitchen to see this. All right. Okay, let's go here, talk to this person. Hello. Oh. This is Luff the Sailor. The old salts back home said we'd never find the island because there will always be bad winds. We sure proved them wrong. Okay. Yeah, looks like we're almost there. Who's this? Attack the sailor. <laughs> the names are good. So the legend is true. There really is an island kingdom? I wonder if we'll see any strange new creatures. Oh, I'm hoping so. I have been watching this game on Twitter, and there are all kinds of lovely creatures we can find out about. Oh. All right, Captain Pullen. If that compass of yours is right, Gamea should be just behind that bank of fog. Oh. Are you ready to finally see the island? I think I'm ready. Let's go. Okay, we have a bit of a, a rainstorm here. Yeah. The fog is nothing to worry about. I'll get Luff the Sailor on the bell to warn passing ships that we're near. Okay. Hold on tight. It's only getting rougher. Oh my god, there's like a tornado-y thing in the... Oh no, it's not. It's just the way the clouds are. Whoa. This is rough times. Really rough. Is this Luff the Sailor? Why did the winds turn on us? Everything was going so well. Oh. Whoa, this isn't looking good. Oh, might have problems. This could be rough. Oh. <gasps> no. Fear not, Sprite Seer. You and your friends are safe. You will see them again, but first you have a great task ahead of you. I am Airy, once a proud protector of these lands. I have been waiting for you. Please, may I see your compass? 
Okay, so we could press R for our compass. Ooh, nice. Okay. As I thought, a celestial compass, use it whenever you are lost. It will guide you truly, but for now your path is blocked. My family can help you, but they themselves are lost. Find them and they will lead you home. Now, Sprite Seer, awaken. Your journey has only begun. Okay, and that looks like the remnants of our ship. Uh, no chance of getting back that way. This is, uh, this is not great. But I think we are where we want to be. So let's get through here. Can we open up this crate? No? Okay, no crate opening. Anything there? No? Oh, what is this? What did I miss? Oh, a stone. Let's pick up the stone. Right, we discovered stone. Hooray. I'm gonna pick up all the crafting materials I can because I think this game has quite a lot of crafting in it uh, at some point. What's that strange blue go? Blue glow, pardon me. Wait in this water as well. Is there anything out here? No. Some crates back here. But we can't open them, alas. Okay, well, let's go back. Go back to dry land. No need to get all soggy and wet, even though we've sort of doused ourselves in water at the moment. Okay, there we go. Ooh! And ooh! <laughs> A human! It's been a long time since I've talked to a human. All of the people who could talk to me have gone away. Please take me with you. I don't want to be alone anymore. All right, we discovered Sprite Lumi. Right, this looks like a kind of a throne, doesn't it? Very funky. Maybe that's where Lumi likes to sit. Okay, we got that stone. Hurrah. And a mushroom. Pick that up? Yes, we can. We discovered a mushroom. More mushrooms? stuff. More stones. Great. Another stone. Oh, we have a bit of a thing happening. The way out is just past the murk. It's bad stuff for you humans, though. I'll try to get rid of it, but I am not sure I can do it alone. Oh, and there it goes. She did it. I think it's a she. Call her a she. Phew, that was hard. I wish I had my brothers and sisters to help me out. If we work together, I think we can find them. Sounds like a great plan to me. Um, let's go and find them. Wow, very pretty. It almost reminds me of the uh, the latest Legend of Zelda game. I, I don't have have a game system for that, but um, I've seen people play it, and it's lovely. This is very, very pretty. Ooh, there's a village over there. Let's go check it out. You really aren't looking the best. I bet we can find some help there. Remember, if we get lost, you can use your celestial compass. It's useful to map out your travels, too. Anyway, let's head over to the village. Okay, let's look at the map. What is that about? Okay, so this is where we kind of came in here. Ooh, there's stuff things here. The region is suffering. We have a one and a half times harvest bonus. There is stuff going on. I don't even know what all that means. Um, I don't know how much we'll be in charge of, uh, if anything. I do not know. I think I just missed the window on the right. Um, I'm going to go and look around here. See if, if there's anything we can find before we go where they're telling us to go. Because I like to explore. I like to find things. Oh, what's a chest? Oh, and we have been rewarded. Red shampoo. You know, I was looking for that. They, they, read, my, <laughs> they read my mind. What do I do with shampoo out here? Oh, my God. Ooh, a stick. I've got a stick. Nice. What else is out here? There's another stick. All right, and a stone. And what is this? Is that kind of pick that up? Vines. All right. Okay, a stick. Thank you. I'll take your sticks. And this as well. Okay. Oh, we can get crafting. You can craft items through your journal. Not sure how to pick that. Like, some. There must be a, a, a hotkey for it. I will look. 
Uh, but we're gonna figure out how to get to where we're supposed to go as well. That looks like a village up there. Is that where we're supposed to go? Oh my god, there's an animal. I want to go look at the animal. Let's go at the animal. Hello. This is a Groffle. Hi, Groffle. Can I pat you? No. Ride you? No, not really. <laughs> he wants to turn his back to me. Oh, what is that? Is that something? Oh, a little, uh, a little, like, a worm thing. Cute. Awesome. I like it. These are funny looking stones. Oh, there's a person there. If a villager has a snock, it means they want to talk to you. Oh, look at this. I like the sign. Oh, what does the sign say? Let's ask the sign. Springmore. All right. There's a person over there. Should we go in the village? Let's go. This is Fairmont. Oh. This is Master Lowe. Hello, traveler. You look like you've been through some hard times. Oh. Please come inside. I can offer you some warm food and a soft bed. Sounds good to me. I just had a shipwreck. The townsfolk warmly welcome you. Once your belly is full and your worries are eased, your head hits the soft pillow and you drift to sleep. <laughs> there, that's much better. You look ready to face the world again. Just one more thing before you go. Ever since that terrible accident years ago, Merc has been popping up all over the place making life difficult. But the people here are friendly and we love to share what we know. Ask around and you'll soon have all the skills you need to make your way in this world. You have new clothes. Um, use... Is it F to check them out? No, whoops. You can find Sly McWiley just on the ridge near the beach. Okay, ha, what... Is that enter? No, this is jump. Let me look at the options. Options. I'm playing with a keyboard and mouse at the moment. What do they mean by this? Player menus. Uh, what is that? I'm looking at my keyboard right now. It kind of looks like a delete. But I'm pretty sure I don't... <laughs> is it tab? Is it tab? Yes, it is tab. Aha. Okay. We have a lot of stuff. How nice. Right. So we have tattered britches and a tattered coat. Um, the coat certainly didn't. Okay. I see. So we took off our old clothes and we now have the new ones on. Fantastic. Here's our regular clothes. Oh, we now look like this. Oh, fan. Look at this. We have orange pants by sheer coincidence today. My favorite color is orange. This is really, really very, very handy. Okay. We have our rucksack. What else do we have? Key items. Crafting. We can make twine, which is made with two vines, or we can make cooked fish. Or, no, no, somebody cooked that for us, I think. Probably carpenter, chef, constructor. Ooh, we can make all kinds of stuffs, I think. Um, so, to make cooked. F Why do are these recipes or are these actual fish? I wonder. Seems like there are a lot of them if it's just... Oh, there's different kinds of fish. I see. There's a princess fish, lucky silverfish, and you need coal to cook them. This one's meat. Groffle milk. Now we know what to do with a groffle. And fodder makes also twine. And you can make it from vines as well. Right. Cool. Lumi. Close to light. Personality gentle. We found one of 26 of these guys. Lumi is a young and gentle sprite that just needs a bit of encouragement. Well, I will try to encourage Lumi to the best of my ability. Now, we have found a gruffel. Uh, apparently, it's not the first animal we're supposed to find, but we did find it anyway, which is kind of exciting. What's the Znok about? The Znok is our um, uh, quest list. Nice. Okay, so we need to talk to Merrick, Sly McWiley, and Minnie. Oh my gosh, it's gotten very dark. I don't know if that happens naturally or if I'm just slow at this or just kind of discovering stuff, which probably is the case. I don't know. Okay, there's this knocked person down there, but I, <laughs> I just sort of run around the top of the village here. What is this? Wow. Lights are very bright here. This is kind of cool. So it's like a village that has two entrances. That's kind of fun. What is this? Is that another? Oh, it's another stone. I thought it was that animal that I'm supposed to find. That one. Aha! You discovered a spotted brown cat. One cat found in the grasslands. Eight more to go. Right. 
I'm gonna look for all the cats <laughs> at some point. Um, ooh, some vines. Take them, thanks. Can I? No, nothing I can pick up there, right? Oh, here's this knocky person. Hello. Huh. Hugh. Oh, hi. I heard there was a new face in town. So you want to learn the ways of a trader, eh? Uh. Well, it's not all just swapping stuff for other things, you know. A trader has to get creative, too. Oh. Here, go grab me a vine and three times sticks, and I'll share a trade secret with you. All right, we have stuff already, so let's talk to him uh. again. All right, so those things I got you to grab aren't actually for me. They're for you. Mm -hmm. As well as making trade deals, you can craft items to trade. Crafted items generally trade for a higher price, which is nice. Ah. You know, I would have said the same thing. It is nice. <laughs> Here's the recipe to craft a bundle of sticks with those items you grabbed. Just remember, you need a recipe and the correct items to craft. Fantastic, I've made a bundle of sticks. Now what do we do with these sticks? <laughs> Making a bundle, that's very clever. I like that name of the quest. So how do I, hi, can I do anything else with you? Yeah. No one likes to think about what happened to the old kingdom. Uh, I wouldn't hmm. know. Having Maeus the Hopeful Beast disappear from the night sky is a bad omen. A very bad omen. Uh. If you look after the land, the land will look after you. How much yeah. text do they have? I think sprites are what used what used to make Gamea flourish. Oh. Sometimes I look at the night sky and wonder, what happened to all the constellations we used to know? Uh, oh, okay, he's tired of talking to me. <laughs> There's people here. All right, what do you guys do? do you, are you traders? Hi. Okay, you are traders. So we can trade things. Uh, and I guess we request things. Potato seeds, herb seeds, sticks, meadow bell seeds. Now, I have heard that there is farming in this game as well. So this may be the beginnings of that. I have played Stardew Valley, and I absolutely love that game. Uh, so this could be a lot of fun. Um, so I have these items, I think. And are they going to sell me these items? Is that what how it works here? I don't quite know what to do with this. Do you got wait? How much do you um, F right? Uh, so these are <laughs> so mushrooms are very very nice here. They sell for thirteen or sell for five, and I have thirteen of them. This is f or wait, how do I even? No, here's my backpack. Here we go. Right, where's that bundle of sticks that we had? Uh, we don't know. I don't know. Let's try it again. Let's make another bundle of sticks. Uh, whoops, tab. There we go. We go to crafting. Right. Can be using crafting or starting fires. Oh, I made one. Nice. So let's find out how much these things are worth. You crafted a bundle of sticks. Good. Um, there we go. Right. Plus 10%. Uh, so this will give us 11. How much is a regular stick? Stick is two, so three of those, that's six plus five is 11. So it doesn't actually benefit us to make a bundle of sticks. It's still the same price. <laughs> oh, too funny. Right, okay, so I'm not going to deal with these trader people just now. Hi. I hope there are better trades. Yeah. Merrick, that storm that capsized your boat, it also destroyed the east docks. Now that's a big problem for us. Mm -hmm. This is a trade guild, you see. Without the east docks bringing in goods, we're not in any position to help you out. Oh. Let's see here. Take this mallet and gather some stone for Marina. Adex stone should be plenty to prop the east docks back up. Oh. You'll find stone around the grasslands and near the cliffs. Once you've got enough, deliver them back to Marina on the beach. Okay, I have uh, quite a lot of stuff. You have a new tool. Use Q or E to select it, right? Okay, use it to smash boulders. Oh, I have seen the boulders before. Um, how do I... This is a regular stone. Is this a boulder? I think. Aha, smash. Okay, we have to kind of whack it several times. Oh, nice. They, we automatically pick those up if they have those uh, borders around them. Okay, it looks like we're not messy with this. We're okay. Hi. How are you? This is Violet. 
I want to become a comedian. They can make a person smile and laugh just using words. Mm. But I'm missing that one special joke. The one that'll make everyone laugh. My masterpiece, my epic joke. Oh. Well, I know I won't find it standing around chatting all day. Mm. I need to get out into the world and seek out my epic joke. Oh. I hope we'll run into each other again. Oh. See ya. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's the most bizarre thing ever. All right. Uh, sure. Why not? What is this? Oh, that's a little lightning bug thing. All right, cool. I just want to pick up a couple of more items out here. There's another stick. Uh, there's some barrels. Can I smash these barrels? Oh, I can. Oh, blueberry seeds. Yes. So now we can even go back to that cave where we arrived because there are a ton of things in there. There's all kinds of crates and barrels and things. All right, let's go ahead and hit this a couple of times. Smash. Boom. Woohoo. I am enjoying this. I really am. This is so fun. <laughs> this is great. Oh, there's a vine. Okay, I'll take your vine. I wonder how often the resources renew themselves. That this I do not know. I have no idea. What is this? Okay, let's open this barrel. Come on. Crack it open. Oh, herb seeds. Alright, alright. So I don't know if this game is more like a continual farming type game. Uh, or if it's more like you just complete quests and then you're sort of done, if it's more of like a story game. Um, but I'm going to explore it and figure that out. Oh, there's an animal up there. I don't think I've seen that one before. Let's see if I can find a way to get up there. Looks like at the end of this little platform here. Do, 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 do. There we go. I need a rope so I can climb these things. I don't, and I don't know if there are like enemies either. What is that? Grass fox. Hi. I'm not going to smash you. Oh, there's a meow. There is a meow somewhere. I heard it. Um, I hope that wasn't the grass fox that meowed at me. Is it on the left? Okay, I don't know. Is it up there meowing at me? Can I jump there? Hello. Let's uh, do a little bit of platforming here. Yes, I found you, tiny cat. I found you. Oh, I found the cat in the box. Yay. All right, seven more to go. Hi. Sorry to disturb you. I didn't mean to. Smash this thing. Boom. <laughs> this is just... I absolutely adore the lighthearted atmosphere of this game so far. This is so just, just lovely. I want to explore and look and find and figure things out. Oh, that was so cool. Did she have, like, an umbrella? Oh, oh, look, mouse. Mouse can move things. That's very nice. Mouse wheel. You don't have to use Q and E if you don't want to. Let's grab that flower on our way. There's another flower over here. My flower. I admit I've lost the village. Oh, there it is. Okay, I can see the sails. That's lovely that you can, like, see things from a distance. That's very nice. Very, very nice. Whack. I discovered a plank. Cool. So is that something I need to pick up now from all the barrels that I've smashed? <laughs> no, apparently not. What is this? Is this something real? No. Okay, can't interact with that. Alas. Pick up this rock. There's more stuff here. Okay, nothing there that I can see. We could go back up to the, the cave. Um, let's do that. Let's go into the cave and see if there's anything good in those uh, those barrels that we um, that were in the beginning area. Do, 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 do. Wait, I didn't leave one. Right? No, no. Okay, great. Going back up. Back up to the world. Any vines here that I can take advantage of? No. All right. I know that if I don't do this, I'll forget, so... Oh, there we go. Smashing time. Kaboom! There's nothing here? Please. Gotta have something. There's a plank there. We've got a plank, right? Let's go down here, so we know there's stuff behind here. Can we smash this? No? Smash these, though. I'm ready for it. Really? Oh, what is that? 
Oh, I can smash all this stuff, too. Ooh. Oops, I didn't mean that. That was the uh, R. I accidentally R'd. Well, that's... <laughs> okay, what about here? Can I smash this? Yes. Ah, oh, we found a secret area. Hello. F. That looks creepy. Prove your resourcefulness. The potential to create and learn helps shape the future. Oh. Craft five items and then re return to the stage. Sa sage stone. The sage stone. Oh, this is cool. I'm going to take a screenshot of this because it is just cool looking. What is this? This is another place we can... F. Boom. There's more stuff. I, I would really like some of these things to contain things. I got something from that one. I don't know what it was exactly, though. Okay, anything else? There's another mushroom. I don't know if these grew back or if I just didn't get them initially. What, what was that? Oh, they did grow back. They grew... The, the stone grew back. <laughs> uh, nothing there. Alright, that's fine. Um, were there any other things? I don't think so. <gasps> Whoa. Uh, can I get out of here? That's the... Oopsies. Okay. Yeah, they uh, sort of <laughs> brought me back to, to reality there. Right. I don't think there's any more that we can get, so let's go back to the village again. You know, just as, as uh, I don't know how long the game takes or what exactly its composition is. So I've been very, very avoidant of watching other people play this game because I really want to go through the experience myself. It's so much more fun discovering things on your own, I think. Uh, at least for me it is. Um, that I just want to experience it. Oh, how pretty that looks. What a lovely picture. Okay, I'm just going to screenshot this uh, because it's good. Oh, <laughs> this umbrella with the light in it, no less. <laughs> That's fantastic. Oh, this is so incredibly charming. This game. This is this is very cool. Okay, is there anything else? There's stuff everywhere. There's fun stuff all over the place. Is it flower? Wait, did I miss that flower? Come on, grab it. Gotta grab and go. Oh, there's an animal. Can I milk you? Not yet. Okay, that's fine. Something here. There's, oh, what is this? Oh, how long? I found another kitty. One cat found in the grasslands. Fantastic. Okay, so let me look at our quests again. We wanted to go to somewhere. Uh, it's the Znaki thing. Sagestone, East Docks. Uh, or we can talk to Peeps. Yes, let's go to Marina, wherever she is. Um, ooh, look at all the fireflies. Cool. She's still searching for her epic joke. Let's look for our... Where does the compass take us? Okay, rotate camera J and L. Right. Okay, we are going that way. Please. Um, this way. Some way, right? R. Okay, there we go. We're going that way. Oh, at the docks. Well, that would make sense because there's water over there. Oh, who is this person? Hello? Oh, ho, ho. Sly McQuarrie. <laughs> Hello! So you're the traveler who washed ashore earlier, eh? Well, no wonder. You look a little wimpy to me. <laughs> it's important to be strong and healthy. I have You have to have big muscles like me to cut fodder all day long. Yeah. Here, take this sickle and show me what you got. Cut the long grass and bring me ten fodder. Yeah. Pop these details into your journal in case you forget. Okay, let's use the sickle. And we'll... Nice. We're just gonna F the, the fuzz out of this field here. Nice. Oh, it's all over the place. How cool is this? Great. What is that thing? No, it's okay. Alright, it's fine. This F. Nice. And when I say F the 
the, 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 the fuzz off of the split. I really do mean F. You use the key F. I do not mean any other um, words that are unsuitable for human consumption. <laughs> right. Hello. Uh -oh. That long grass didn't stand a chance. <laughs> it's all chopped off. How lovely. You're not as wimpy as I thought. Mm. Like I said, having big muscles is important. But it's important to have a big brain like me, too. Uh... That way you can get other people to cut your fodder for you. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> I love that. That is so funny. <laughs> uh. There's a rumor that Mocha Bay is desperate to get rid of all their decoration goods. Oh, <gasps> We should go there. We should go there. There are birds here meowing like crazy. Uh, right. <laughs> so now we can, uh, anytime we find long grass, tall grass, we can get that. We can get more fodder. Don't know if we have a limit in our backpack or not. No idea. But we'll find out, I'm sure, eventually. Is there anything up here? Seashells? I can... Oh, there's a chest. Hi, chest. I'm coming for you. Let's look. Black ring. <laughs> Rimmed glasses, all right. Again, another item that I just was thinking about, right? Okay, let's not stand on the fire. Not that it matters that much, but hi. Oh. You are Marina. <laughs> Fancy that, having a name like Marina, right next to the docks. And this goes here, and that goes... Oh, hello there. <gasps> Whoa, you've got everything I need to finish up? Sure beats me trying to piece it back together with driftwood and crab shells. Ooh. It'll be done in a jiffy. The trade will start coming through to Fairmont once again. All right. Completed that quest. Cool. Oh, it looks very nice. Look at that. Oh, and there's a blue glow in the boat. Okay, let's see what else she has to say. Oh. East Docks is back up and running, and I can resume my post as Dockmaster. All thanks to you. Well, you're very welcome. Oh, there's more people. So you're a trader, too. Hi. I have, oh, they have stuff. They have all kinds of things that I don't know if I need yet. They do sell these replacement items if I lose one. Oh, this is interesting. Plus 10% in red. And this is plus 10% in green. I admit I do not understand the trading system just yet. Uh, but I'm not going to, oh wow, look at how much these cost. But I wonder if I could like wear those or um, put them on my character. I can't smash those things. <laughs> yeah. Rufus, here's a tip. There's a lot of interest in anything clothing related in fiffle dip tanners. <laughs> okay. All right. Huh. The elders say uh, say that Gold Lake got its name from the goddess blessing the land with sun and water. Well, that's very pleasant. Who are you? Hi. Um. Francis. Why is it that every time I catch an old soggy boot, it's the left one? You know, if you're looking for old soggy boot pairs, you really should, yeah, be careful. Uh. Get your fishing pole out. Why don't the sprites do any something about the merc? Well, they're probably not capable of it. They need help or something. I bet we're going to learn how to fish at some point. All right, let's go talk to the guy in the boat. <laughs> this is such a goofy game. <laughs> I'm enjoying this immensely, I have to say. Hello. How are you doing? You have meat. You have heartwood. Oh my god, that's so funny. <laughs> I used to be a woodworker in real life, and that's just hilarious. Heartwood. <laughs> I am immensely amused. Right. Okay, so we have... We can scroll down this list. There is a ton of stuff here. What is this? Bits and bobs. I love that. There is a category of things called bits and bobs. We've got fluff, golden mint. These are my kind of items. I can I can get behind this. Um, do you have different prices for things? No. I don't know what I need yet. So we need to talk to Minnie. Oopsies. Can I get in this boat? Aha. Being stuck in there was a real drag. This is Locke, who looks like a cat. Anyway, let's shove off and get me stowed in that backpack of yours. Uh, really? Alright, I need to find another sprite in the grasslands. Can I, I can't do anything in the boat. Alright, um, 
guess that's it. I'm, I'm feeling very cold. I need to get out of this rain. Um, I mean, I don't even know if my character is, but it seems logical to be feeling cold. Maybe my air conditioning is up too high. <laughs> All right, let's open these boxes and things. Anything? No, nothing. There's a bit of a rock here. Let's smash this thing. I know we're probably going to need more stone. Maybe we can sell bundles of stone as well. So we need to talk to Minnie. Uh, and I forget where Minnie is. Let's, um, oh, this, I don't know if this leads where I want it to go, but discovered a sprig pig. Where? Is it in this uh, bush? I don't know. I discovered something. I don't even know what it is. Oh, there's different flowers here. Hi. Butterberry flower. <laughs> what is this? The sprig pig seems interested in your mushroom. Give it to it? Yes! I will give it a mushroom. <gasps> oh, how cute! <laughs> oh my god. This is the most adorable thing ever. Can I give you another mushroom? Yes. I'll, I'll give it as many as it needs. I want to get, I want to tame this pet. Yes. Is there more that I can... Go, go. Do I have a, a panel for relationships? Like, how can I get this spring pig to love me? <laughs> oh my goodness. Wow, we have two old kingdom coins. Oh, this is just lovely. Right, Lumi, pets, spring pig. A small foraging animal that grows flowers on its back. I'm tempted to give it just every mushroom that I own, but I don't know if that means it'll follow me around. I mean, because it is... Wait, where, how many mushrooms do I have? That's my question now. Two left. I'll give it all the mushrooms. Here. Yes. Will you follow me now? Oh, it wants to... This? No, was that instruction for the from the sprig pig? No, probably not. It was probably from just uh yeah. Alright, well I'll remember where you are, Sprig Pig. because uh, I'm gonna tame you one day. Oh, there's other stuff up here. What is this? Hello? It's like a fish festival. I'm probably playing this game all wrong. <laughs> I don't know. But hello. Huh. This here is a fishing competition. To enter, you need to find yourself a fishing pole. Come back when once you've got one. Oh, so this is a fish festival. Look at that. Nice. Look, look at the detail. They're like, you know, just wiggling in the rain. It looks so good. Wow. I'm just, I'm very impressed. I'm very impressed. All right, we're going to go back to where we're supposed to be. Because I'm really good at <laughs> being where I'm not supposed to be. What is this? Can can we clear the murk? Yes. To purify the murk, you must use sprites you found. I need another sprite. Okay. Um, is that the docks down there? Probably. Oh, yeah. Here's our sprig pig. Hi. And he knows I have no mushrooms. See, that's the thing. Oh, you can use your mouse button to, to also click. Alright, I didn't realize that. All right, let's go back. I think Minnie is probably in the village. Let's use our compass and find out. Yep, I bet so. Here we go. There's that guy. Nice. We cut his fodder for him. But, I mean, the joke's on him, because we actually got the fodder in our backpack, so he didn't really benefit too much from that, I think. Let's get this. Pick up vines. Thank you very much. And, um... Who's Minnie? I forgot who Minnie is. What does this say? I am looking for st one stone fence. If you bring them to me, I will reward you. That's Minnie. So she must be in here. Uh, sure. I will build a fence if I figure out how to build one. Hi. Is this Merc? Oh. Merrick. Merrick. Sounds like Cinderton really needs to get rid of their masonry stock. Okay, so uh, maybe we can help them out with that. So I may have to buy a fishing pole, or unless someone has a um, a quest for me where I can just pick it up. 
uh, and win one, essentially. Oh, there's a staircase. I don't think I've been there. Here's Minnie. Hmm. I hear you're in need of a roof over your head. Well, you're in luck. The old farm in the south field was abandoned when the murk appeared. If you can clear the murk, you're welcome to the farm. I'd love to see the old place patched up and running again. Take this axe and gather some materials to fix the place up. Sixteen wood and five sticks should be plenty. The farm is in the south fields through the big tunnel. You can't miss it. Uh, okay. Now, I don't have another... Well, maybe I don't need another um, sprite. Maybe this is a different sprite quest than that other place that I just found. I don't know. I forgot to look at my map. <laughs> ah, okay. So this is the farmhouse. This is the other merc that we found. And what is this? Is this the festival? Possibly? Maybe. This is nice. I like this quest. It's good. All right, what's up here? Oh, a chest. Hi, chest. How you doing? You discovered twine. That's very handy. All right. Let's go out. Okay. Let's go out of here. Uh, and look at our map again. Which way are we facing? We're facing the wrong way altogether. So we need to be facing this away. Let's go and get some... I oh, there's the Merc. I can see it from here. All right. It's a couple of bits of stone. Some stuff. Crate smash. Boom. We got one iron ore. Nice. And now we also have a an axe. Can we maybe cut down this tree? Whoops. Go, go, go. We get wood. Nice. Okay. I love that. I love that she has this umbrella. <laughs> it's just like, has a light in it. I mean, they think of everything. It's so cool. Oh, is this... Can I um, smash this boulder? Is it too big? Probably too big. Right. I'm going to go get some of those trees on the left there. Because I don't want to mess up my own farm until I figure out what I want to do with it. Because I don't know if the trees are going to grow back there or not. So, let's go get our chopping thing. Whack, whack, whack. Boom. Right. What is that noise? Sounds very peculiar. Can I chop this stuff? What is this? Possibly not a wood tree. It's a something else tree. Cool. And looks like we're getting some sticks as well. I hope these trees grow back. Pretty sure they should. This seems like a fairly magical area. But maybe the birds are yelling at me because um, I've just <laughs> redecorated their living arrangements, unfortunately. Okay, we're getting some planks here. We're getting other stuff. Okay, we got to clear the murk and that's all we got to do. Let's go. <laughs> this is just lovely. Oh, this game. I had no idea I would enjoy it this much. I really had no idea. I saw it, and I saw the story, and I really wanted to play, and so I requested a key months and months ago because it looks like so much fun. And I have to say, so far, we're, what, 42 minutes in, and I am just having an absolute blast. All right, there's the Merc. Okay, what else we got here? Nothing. Oh, there's more murky stuff over there. Gosh, the whole place is filled with this stuff. Hi. Let's go fix this. To purify the murk, you must use sprites that you have found. What? I need even more. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is obviously a higher level quest, perhaps. Uh-huh. Right. Um, okay, well, having said that, I think what we're going to have to do is, um, so that my internet does not die, I will have to end the episode right now. What was this? Oh, this is one of those little worm guys. Those are cute. Um, <laughs> we're going to have to go on some other quests and basically find more sprites. Uh, figure out where they are. Maybe they're hanging around around people um, and whatnot. But we'll leave that to the next episode. So thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other. And I'll see you next time.